All right, time to do the setup for email password authentication. All right, and what I'm gonna do for, for each of these in this unit uh, is we'll do the setup on Firebase and then we'll go write the code in our, in our client, right? And then we'll do our second one, Google, then we'll do our third one, Rosoff, and sort of following that, that, that one-two punch in each one. Okay. Uh, so we've got some setup, uh, very straightforward. It literally is gonna take you four clicks here. Um, so you're gonna wanna click on auth, right? Uh, then you're gonna wanna go to sign in method for the second one. And you'll see it's gonna give you a list and you're gonna click on enable. So email password, um, click on that. Um, it's going to expand. You'll enable it. Your third click, and then go ahead and save it, and you 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 then you're authenticated, right? So um, off sign in method. I already enabled mine, but clicking it, you see that it's enabled, and I save it. Right? Uh, super super simple. Okay. Now while we're in uh, our console, we're also going to want to create a couple of users for testing. So there's also a users tab there, and you can add users. Um, I'll mention right now that, that emails um, are going to have an at symbol in them um, and the password length is, is at least six, I think is actually enforced on the back end, right? Um, now, we can, we can do this, all right? So users, and I've already have a few here, but I'll add another one just for fun. So add user, and I have an a at b.com, so I'm going to make a c at d.com with a password of just ddddd, all right? So sort of minimal and easy for me to remember. Um, certainly not very secure. Click add user, and then they're there, um, and they're ready for us to, to log in, right? Now, honestly, what you would really do, okay, um, you could do a, a couple of things. So our client doesn't support creating new ones. It just has logging into existing accounts, just for simplicity. Um, but what might you do? Maybe you have, you know, it's, it's a web client, right, Where's, is where you go ahead and, and do your sign up, right? or maybe in your app you have a create user button and there's documentation for, for doing these things on Firebase's um, site, okay? All right, that's it. Next time we're gonna write the code. Mm -hmm.